Happy Halloween, guys! It's the 31st, 10 a.m. I'm all dressed up in my Halloween cardigan. Yes, my cardigan is my costume. Uh, I'm dressed up as a cardigan. Um, this morning we're all hanging out on the couch. My face got kind of sunburnt yesterday working in the garden. That's alright though. Um, I'm just subtitling yesterday's vlog and then I am spending the day doing uni readings for an essay I have to write. Um, I'd like to get like the outline done today. I think that would be good and other than that we don't really have any plans uh, tomorrow's a public holiday because it's Melbourne Cup Day um, I don't think we have any plans tomorrow either though so we'll see Tilly's been itching really bad from like when we cut the grass and stuff and she's getting her grass allergies so we gave her a antihistamine this morning. Just passed out. It's so cute. Her eyes are open, but she's asleep. She didn't get any sleep last night. She was itching basically the whole night. I know. So this, as soon as she took the antihistamine and it kicked in, uh, like maybe 20, 30 minutes later, she's just been passed out. So happy. I'm not quite sure what Tao is trying to achieve. I think she wants to lie in the sun. Wow, look at that nose art. It's impressive. Snuggling. That's adorable. Mm, they're sort of snuggling. He keeps kicking Tilly in the head. It's lunchtime. I just had a delivery from Booktopia. I'm gonna have a look to see what's inside. I suspect it's something that I can't show on camera because the person who it may be for may watch this vlog, but if I can show anything, I will. Okay, I can show you one of the things. It's Garth Nix's new book, Golden Hand. It's part of the Abhorson series. I'm not really a fan of the cover art, to be honest. Um, yeah, the cover up's not very nice. Hey, cool. This one's actually been, uh, hand autographed. Like, that's texto. That's pretty cool. Did not know I ordered an autographed copy. 
I'm so tempted just to read one chapter, but I know it's not going to stop there. I'm one of those people who, if I start reading a book I like, I will actually just read all of it in one go. Um, and it's not that thick, so it wouldn't take me too long. But ooh, what's that stuff at the back? What is that? Ooh, I could just read this. I could just read this. It's so short. Just a cute little story. I no. I have to study. Okay. This will be my reward for after I finish the essay. found the chicken in like two seconds flat. Now she will proceed to lick its butthole because that's what she likes to do. In the meantime, a wild wolfred has appeared. Oh dear. Oh dear. She's, she's, she's paraplegic in her. She's crawling with the chicken. Tao is enjoying some awkward, I don't know, awkward ab work time. She's got pretty good abs, hey. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, no. The <laughs> abs came out. Don't smack her in the face, Wolfred. She looks headless right now. Oh dear, look at Tilly. Yeah. Where did the chicken go though? It's just but is she crawling to the chicken or is I think she's she just crawling? Oh wait, I can see the chicken dancing over there. Maybe we need one of those like the desk mats with like the knobbly bits on the oh, bottom upside yeah. down. Yeah yeah. <laughs> oh well, at least she's amusing herself. <laughs> this is a new style of playing this uh crawling mm. with a toy. She normally just crawls by herself. And she doesn't seem to crawl with particular purpose. She kind of goes in circles. But now she's doing like zigzags and stuff. Oh dear. 
Fat got a little too frustrated after she couldn't find a double wrapped chicken, so she gave up. You wouldn't know it to look at it, but these are some daddy's girls right here. Nah. But it's okay. Because I get a butt. And a spaz foot. Yeah, oh, Fred, the camera's on. This is going on YouTube, Wilfred. We humiliated in front of the whole internet. No, people are just like dogs who run in circles and chase their tails are like like stressed and anxious and bored and this he's just Wolford though. Bored maybe. But mostly just Wolford. It's just because we're not paying attention to him. So he knows that if he dances we pay attention to him because it's funny. So now we just ignore him when he dances. He's not actually trying to chase his tail either. He shows no interest in his tail. He's just dancing. It is pretty miserable weather outside. <coughs> it's very windy. Not super windy, but it's pretty windy. It's just starting to spit again. It's been raining off and on all day. And there is a cloud over our suburb. We did a normal grocery run, but I thought I'd just show you some of the more interesting things we picked up today. We picked up a lemon cheesecake. This was only $5, so, you know, we don't know what the quality is like, but we thought we'd try it. These mac and cheese balls, which I'm excited about. It's dinner tonight. Some donuts, some gingerbread whirls with cream filling sponge fingers. Stuff to make ramen at home, some tiny teddies, and English muffins to make breakfast sandwiches. Dinner for tonight is strawberry white tea. We, I made some breakfast sandwiches just with bacon and eggs. And the cheese macaroni balls, they're quite small. And they kind of exploded in the microwave, so I don't know how they'll, how they'll go, but... Yeah, doggies are settled in. And we are going to watch the BFG. We finished watching the BFG. It was kind of disappointing. The giant was done really well and I really enjoyed his character and how he was um, like animated. But the girl... Sophie, like, I don't know. I don't remember her character being so obnoxious and annoying. And I thought the actress who played her was kind of bad. Like, I know it's a lot to ask kids to be really good at acting, but at the same time, they're not, because, you know. And who are you to say something about acting if you can't act yourself? But I feel like... Nowadays, there are so many good child actresses that they could have found someone better. But um, the animation was really beautiful for the most part, so... Yeah, I'm glad I watched it, but I probably won't watch it again. I think I'll reread the book, though, because I think I'd like to have that as my last memory of how I uh, experienced the BFG. Um, anyway, it's just about midnight, so I am heading off to bed, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night.